This is December the 25th and I'm here in Phnom Penh, Cambodia, spending Christmas Day. I'm here on uh, street 271, the one that leads to my hotel, the Meredith Hotel. And this is a big street. You can see there are the directions to Priya Monifon Bridge. The city, not really a city, but it's a small town called Takmao. And the Chunak Museum. That's the uh, genocidal center. A place where they, they, they hold a memorial to all the victims that fallen by the um, Khmer Rouge regime. Here we have one of the thousands of carts selling cold drinks scattered around the city. And now I'm gonna show you real life here in Cambodia since I'm off the beating track. I'm off the beating path, yeah. I'm out of the tourist track here now. But still, I'm gonna be able to show you what goes on here on a regular day. There we have one of the hundreds of international schools here in Cambodia, the British Cambodian International School. Something else very common is to find petrol for sale on the streets. It's, it's, uh, most of the time it's cheaper than if you buy it uh, in a gas station. Here we see a woman coming on the wrong way. This is also pretty common. More than one would wish for. Yeah, now here you can see a horde of people riding on the wrong way. And that's why they have so many accidents here. They are very, very reckless when driving. And so, most Cambodians, they park on the sidewalk. It's very rare to find a car parked on a proper lane, yeah, but by the curb and not on the sidewalk itself. We have there some typical stores selling iron materials. <laughs> Cambodian dog, food cart. Cambodian kid, usually very cute kids. Here some masonry. One of the many massage shops. This one doesn't look so fancy. Lucky, there's a Cambodian woman there wearing traditional clothes. Maybe she has a wedding now, I don't know. Then we have there an old lady with the head shaved. I heard they shave the heads here when a relative passes away. We have many Chinese people living here, so you can see there are the Chinese lanterns. A tuk -tuk, wait, waiting for a customer. Oh, this is nice. This is a bakery here. 
you cannot have. And before I came here, I actually thought they didn't eat bread, and I, I thought it would be hard to find, but no, you can find bread, pastry very easily, especially because of the French heritage, French legacy. And I, I think that's it for now. Thanks for watching and you got a small taste of everything Cambodia offers you. A really exotic ride. Okay, Merry Christmas to all. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like it and also click on the ads to help me. Okay, see you all.